It's a tree lined. It looks like it's been here for decades, but it's only seven years old. And it's mature pine trees on a sandy ridge. And it's uh, based on Colin's favorite course with Pine Valley. You'll see that running through the course with the pine, pine trees and the waste areas meandering through the course. Well, it's a thinking man's course, which is, I think, how Colin was like as a player. You have to plan your way around this course. Uh, high fades definitely favoured on most of the holes, which is quite interesting. I don't think it was a design aim, but it seems to have creeped in there. Well, we've worked, we've worked with the tour since about a year ago with Miguel, the tournament director, changing a few greens, a couple of bunkers, tightening up the fairways. Uh, and then generally the rough's been let go a little bit more and obviously the firmness and speed of the greens. Well, you've got two distinct nines here. You've got the back nine, which is a little bit more quirky for the shorter hitters, I think. But then the front nine with the stretch along the, the villas here is going to be a tougher nine holes, more length. It's quite tight, but of the Bellet courses, it's one of the more generous width between the trees. It's, it's been pretty hectic. It's been since we overseeded in September. We've been really trying to protect the course as much as possible, but maintain our resort feeling by being open. So it's been a challenge.